Nell, thank you so much for joining me this afternoon. I appreciate yeah, thank it. Thank you for having me. Uh, congratulations on Bookworm. It was a lot of fun to watch. Uh, tell me a little bit about the film. So the film is about Mildred, who is a, you know, wise beyond her years, precocious child, and her estranged father, who's played by the incredible Elijah Wood, is kind of a washed up magician from America who's seen better days. Um, and they meet together in New Zealand after Mildred's mom has an accident. And they go hunting for the Canterbury Panther, which is an actual New Zealand myth. Um, and they kind of, you know, unite in this search for the panther and grow and develop as characters um, through the journey of the movie. Yeah, it was really nice to see you guys uh, develop that chemistry throughout the film. Tell me a little bit about working with Elijah Wood and, and kind of, you're really, really serious and you do a very good job at, at, at really keeping it cool and, and being very um, reserved, that's the right word. Uh, tell me about working with him and developing that chemistry and, and kind of toning it down from the beginning and where we end up. Yeah, so Elijah was so incredible to work with. He's the sweetest guy, you know, he's so funny and down to earth. Um, but yeah, no, we hit it off instantly as soon as we met. Um, and yeah, so sometimes toning it down and, you know, Mildred is a bit mean to him. Um, and that was, you know, that can only go well if there's, you know, a really good connection between the two actors, um, which, you know, luckily we had. But yeah, it was it was so much fun. <laughs> Was it, was it tough to keep a straight face in some of those scenes? Because I know that like they're supposed to be very serious, especially early on. But I've, I've, as I'm watching, I feel like, I was like, well, I feel like they, them two would be really good friends and you know, off the camera. So yeah. maybe it would take a couple of extra takes. Is that, is that a fair assumption? I mean, yeah. Like sometimes that is times where, you know, I'm yelling at him and I'm saying that he's useless. Um, but I think there is, you know, that balance of, you know, we have so much fun on set, off camera. But, you know, when rolling is called, we are, you know, we are kind of in the zone, we're in character, um, and we're just able to deliver the scene. And speaking about being in character, where did you find your Mildred right, to be that really, really reserved and kind of closed off and really, uh, really kind of mean? It was, it was interested in asking you about that. Yeah, so I think Mildred is kind of a, she's a complicated character um, who's never really had a father figure and so she's kind of adapting to that throughout the film. Um, but I worked kind of on her and on her situation with my amazing acting coach, Claire Chittam. Um, You know, we worked together to see where Mildred has been you know, what she's going through. Um, and then we were just able to kind of develop her as a character. And then, you know, the scenes start making more sense. Um, and, you know, when it's well-written, um, like Bookworm was, it, you know, the character kind of comes naturally, nothing really feels off. Um, and your character doesn't really need an explanation for why they're doing things. Yeah, it's really it's really simple when you're when you're, you have your mom and she's the one who's there with you through thick and thin to be so protective of her to the point where you're looking for a panther in order to to make things better. And then here comes this one guy who's like, here's a magic trick. And, and I think that's mm -hmm. where the uh, uh, <laughs> that's where it all starts off where you get to get the sense of, yes, yeah, this is not going to go well for him for a while. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It yeah. Was, hmm? Go ahead. No, it was, um, yeah, it's, it is quite interesting because, like you said, essentially, Strawn comes in and he tries to wow Mildred with, you know, his magic trick with the cards. And pretty soon he sees that that's not going to work on her, um, which creates quite an interesting dynamic from the start. 
Yeah, it sets the tone, and then you see, you notice yeah. that okay, he's gonna have to do a lot of work because there's no fool in this kid, <laughs> and I, and like and it it's because of the good writing. Uh, now you guys go on a journey. Uh, how do you feel about the outdoors? I really like it. Yeah, I love you know kind of camping, hiking. Um, but it was a lot of fun. Um, we did, you know, we did encounter a couple obstacles. There was a time where we were filming on like a kind of hilly, mountainy, high terrain, and we couldn't get the porta potties um up close enough to the set. And so we used what became known as the thunder bucket. The thunder bucket, that is interesting. <laughs> There's some unresolved trauma there. <laughs> oh, man, but it, it's all part of it. Part of the outdoors experience. Yeah. Also the outdoor part, experience. Yeah, it's what makes it memorable. Actually, that leads me to my final question is, what did you enjoy most about filming Bookworm? I, I loved the scenery the it was so incredible you know the south island canterbury region is just kind of breathtakingly almost unreal um it's just so gorgeous and i remember there was this one day where elijah and i got in a helicopter with and the director and the director of photography and we got up in our helicopter when we dropped down in a certain place and Elijah and I hopped out and the helicopter went up and started filming us. And, you know, we were just walking around um, and, you know, we'd do that in multiple different locations and it was so much fun. Um, it was so stunning. Well, uh, no, uh, no, thank you so much for your time. I'll be honest, it was, a, it was a beautiful film to watch. I'm so jealous of how much time you got to spend with Elijah Wood and because uh, it looked like you guys had a great time and it turned out to be a great film. So uh, thank you for that and congratulations on the film. Thank you so much. It was uh, nice to virtually meet you. Yeah, you too.